Hi everyone, it's Beth, and today I'm making a summertime ribbon wreath. I used a 14 inch wreath ring from Dollar Tree. This summertime lemony ribbon I got from Amazon and some zip ties. First thing I did was opened up the first ribbon and measured out the length at 31 inches and cut that piece. And then from there, I just took that first piece I cut and matched it up with the rest of the ribbons and cut them down to the same size. I used 18 strips, six of each pattern. I ended up cutting more than I needed, but I only ended up using 18 strips altogether. After I had them all cut down, I took one of the ribbons, measured it out five inches, folded it, and then just kept folding it over itself until it made this shape. I made sure to have three folds on each one. And then continue that for the rest of the ribbon strips. After I had them all folded, I took my first ribbon, flipped over my wreath frame, and then put the three folds right through each of those spaces, bunched up the back of the ribbon and put a zip tie around it and just pulled it as tight as you could. And I did not attach it to the frame itself. I just did it to the ribbon. Once I opened up the ribbon on the front, it stays in quite nicely. The ribbon I used is two and a half inches wide and it's wired ribbon. And so once it's opened up, it stays quite nicely. But you can definitely attach it to the frame if you'd like. So after you put them in and they're all in, you'll be opening them like this, just opening up each of those little loops you had made. And it fills it in quite nicely and the ribbon does stay put. So what I did was just kept going. I put the three different patterns in each section. So there's only three ribbons in each of those sections. And then just kept that going all the way around the whole thing until it was nice and full. After I had it all filled in, I just went around and cut down all of the zip ties. Last thing I did was flipped it over and opened up all of the loops all the way around the entire frame. And that is it. Super easy to make, but looks really pretty. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video.